Hi, I'm Mark with Mastercam, and in this video, I'd like to show you how the Milturn machine environments for two and three axis lathes can make it faster and safer to program, thanks to the enhanced machine simulation. Here I have a Haas ST20 SSY lathe, which is running in Milturn simulation. Being able to work in the Milturn simulation means I can simulate all the machine components, work holding, stock, tools, and tool holders. In the Operations Manager, I'm going to select all my operations, then click the G1 button. Normally, the G1 button would post out the code for the selected operations. But since I'm using the Milturn machine environment, the G1 button launches the Sync Manager instead. If I were programming for a multi-stream machine, this is where I would synchronize my operations to avoid machining errors or collisions due to conflicting turret movement. Since the Haas ST20 is a single stream machine, I'm going to use the Sync Manager to post up my code when needed and launch simulation. If I was to look at the operations I selected in simulation, I can see that the tool for operation 29 is too short. So the turret and the tailstock would collide if I were to run this at the machine as it is right now. This is a perfect example of why it's so important to review your toolpaths and backplot simulation before posting them out. This issue would not have shown up in backplot, since it's a collision between machining components, which backplot isn't capable of displaying. Taking a few extra minutes now can save you from ending up with a broken tool, a damaged machine, or simply having to diagnose an unexpected stop. To fix this issue I'm seeing in simulation, I need to increase the projection for my finishing tool. To do this, I'm going to switch back to my main Mastercam window. In the Toolpath Manager, I'm going to click the Tool Setup button. Inside the Tool Manager, I can right-click on Tool 16 and select Set Projection Length. Then, all I need to do is click and drag the arrow to adjust the projection length. I want to add an extra half of an inch to my projection. So to make it easy, I can keep my cursor over the ruler while dragging, and the projection value will snap to specific increments. I can now press Enter to save my changes, close the Tool Manager, relaunch the Sync Manager, and look at my operations and simulation to verify I no longer have a collision. 